Here are a few items that preppers should add to their bug out bags. Freeze dried food. These will last about 30 years. So it's not like canned food where you have to worry about rotating them every couple years. You kind of just put them in your bug out bag and forget about it. To prepare, you just add boiling water straight into the bag, let it sit for a few minutes and then eat. First aid kit and a tourniquet. Try to buy a higher quality first aid kit. Don't buy a $5 one at a bargain shop. Try to buy something that's better quality from camping and outdoor stores. And most kits don't come with a tourniquet, so you'll have to buy it separately. The same thing with the tourniquet. Don't buy the $3 ones. I am amazed at the fact that people are still buying them online and, and expecting them to work. The tourniquet is something that you need in life-threatening situations. If it fails on you, and I guarantee you the $3 ones will, it's going to be a horrible situation. Only buy real tourniquets and from reputable sources. Guys fighting overseas right now are experiencing this firsthand. They're getting hit and trying to use the fake tourniquets, which aren't tightening up and are falling apart when they use them. The next item is a gravity water purification system from Membrane Solutions. It has a four stage water filter that removes a minimum 99% plus of large particles, chlorine, microplastics, odor, and heavy metals and it can filter up to 5,000 liters of water, whereas other brands may only filter 4,000 liters of water. Another thing I like about this one in particular is that it can connect with a water bottle and it comes with a six liter gravity fed water purification system that it can connect to. So all you have to do is fill it from your water source, attach your filter, hang it up from a tree or anywhere else and just drink from the straw then you and even your group will immediately have filtered and clean drinking water. Most other companies will sell you a water filter straw on its own, but if you're in something like a survival situation, there's no guarantee that you'll always find a water source to drink from. There may be times where you won't find another water source at all. So with the bag, once you find a water source, you can fill it up with six liters of water and carry drinkable water with you. And there's also an option to clip it to your backpack as well. And even if you aren't in a survival situation and are just with a group at a campsite that has a questionable water source, you fill this bag from that water source, hang this from a tree, attach the filter, and you all will have drinkable water. If you guys are interested in this, I'll have the link in my bio. It'll be under Simpure Life or Survival Water Filters. Once you're on the site, just go to Water Filter Systems, then click on Outdoor Water Filters. Once you're at checkout, use my code AC20. That will get you 20% off your order. A multi-tool, specifically a high quality multi-tool like one from Leatherman. You can use the knife blade, use the wire cutter, you can use the multi-tool for making repairs, making shelters, and so much more. A multi-tool is definitely a no-brainer for your bug out bag. NOAA radio. It will give you every weather alert in your area, such as hurricanes, tornadoes, and severe storms. You can buy battery powered or hand crank ones. Both have their own benefits. If you have any suggestions on what else should be added to a bug out bag, leave it in the comments.